Giant sorrows in the bottle, but forgot sorrow knows how to swim. Keep on persevering, y'all, that's how you win. If they coast not foolishness, they not your friends. I stay away from drama like a CNN. Minds on the eternal like I see in it. Don't let the captain hook you, fly like Peter Pan. 90 doesn't do it, nope, I need a 10. With dead inside, got back to like What's goody? It's your boy G Reason from Life Music, and this is behind the bars of Reload. So, if you're familiar with my music, our music, when me and my wife do a track together, it's usually more conceptual. Um, it's usually it's, it's, it's song structure. So it's verse, hook, bridge, or bridge, hook, <laughs> verse. Who starts with bridge first? Anyway, but when I do my own like Freestyle Fridays or just drop a verse then I'm usually just trying to be as punchy as possible. Punchline after punchline. So for this Summer Staycation 2 project, I'm like, we need something um, that kind of puts people in the mind of, I have this series called Bar Buffet. It's just one long verse and it's just full of bars, like a buffet. Pull up at a buffet, you got chicken, you got steak, you got beef. You don't need nothing else but your meat. So I'm like, I need something along that vein where it's just one long verse and punches, boom, 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 boom. So the concept of reload came from that. And then the journey begins to find a beat to kind of fit that. And I found this beat and the piano was just dun, dun, dun. heavy, kind of dark, but at the same time, kind of epic. Dun, dun, dun. So the track was hard, it was bananas, and it was pretty consistent. Like there wasn't any real big change up, no drops, no key changes, which is dope for if you just want to do bars. You don't have to lose track, the, the beat didn't change, like the tempo didn't change, there was no um, overpowering instruments or nothing like that. So I'm like, it's, it was pretty consistent, just started writing. Then I got down to the writing process. So when any artist is putting the song together, you have generally what's called placement holders. That's when you don't have a full song, but you have ideas, maybe melodies, um, certain words like a topic, um, a tempo, a cadence. If you're a rapper, you're working with your cadences, your nuances, your, your articulations. It's an art form, you know what I'm saying? Music is art. So here are some of my early placement holders. I didn't have all the words. I didn't know where I was going to go, but this was the early stages. I should probably label my voice recording so I know exactly what I'm pulling up. So that was like the first initial like mumbling. And then this is when I put like words instead of just mumbling. So, just know I got God on my. So, I initially wanted to say reload, like big hook, like repeat it, that type of thing. But as you know, if you heard the final product, we scratched that idea. <laughs> 